now. Um, we're going to Uniform shopping, aren't we, Shavian? Yeah. So we've got Shavian and Willie May with us. Um, so we've come to town for. I hope you can hear us. I think we'll have to start shouting, won't we? I know, yeah. Um, what shoes? I don't know. Yeah. You don't know what you're going for yet? Yeah. No. Um, and she needs a handbag. Go okay. So I'm doing one at a time. So Shannon's going to be today. Then I need to take. And I'm going to do. I might see if we can get Isabel shoes. Oh, watch the show. It makes me nervous now because it's so, so busy. Um, I might get some nice shoes for Isabella on the Ando market. You know, pick them up while we're here. Um, so, yeah. It's busy in it, isn't it? It's always it's busy in town. We don't really come to town, do we? I know, but it's only early time. Yeah. We don't really come to town. We was going to go Berry, but I thought, no. No, because we've got to go on and look for socks and stuff for school. Uh, we don't really have a big selection, do they? No. In um, the Primark in Berry, because it's only small. So, yeah, so, let's see when we get in the air, let's look at some shoes. <laughs> How cute are these guys? Seriously? Oh. <laughs> Beautiful. Gorgeous. Them. <laughs> I was just going to point at them ones then. Um, let's have a look at them. Them diamond ones are nice. Nice them, aren't they? Yeah, you got me them boots last year. Was it for my birthday? No. I can't even remember. What was it? I, I like the one with the see-through heel. Yeah, they're nice, aren't they? The see-through Yeah, the see-through heel, I like them. Should we school them? In what? <laughs> yes, Shannon, yeah. you can have them for school. Oh, look at this. How beautiful this is. I know, I'm here with this picture in there. Oh. Look at that. All oh, the boots are coming back out, because it's going to be spring, is it? Not spring. Um, autumn, so yeah, I've still got my boots, Shannon got me, so yeah, they're different. Mm. What have you done, aren't you, Shannon? Yeah. She did have it done, she got it done last year, but you ended up taking it out, didn't you? So yeah. she's excited now because she's getting it done again, aren't you? Get excited. What colour bar are you going with? Uh, we can't film inside, guys, we're not allowed. I mean, light like blue. You're going for light like blue? Yeah. Ooh, right then. We'll see if you've had it done. Yeah. She's got it done. Do you think it hurt more this time than last time you had it done? Yeah. Yeah, I could tell in your face that it hurt more. Last time, last time I was just like, oh, yeah. Yeah. But not this time, it's like, oh, it was a pain. <laughs> but I think that's because she had to reopen her home. So yeah, yeah. yeah. It looks nice though. She's gone for a blue belly bar now, aren't ya? Yeah. Oh, it looks really nice. It looks all trendy. <laughs> you okay now? Yeah. Do you sit down? I'm a big girl, Mum. <laughs> it looks nice. No, looks nice, don't it, Lilla? Yeah, I can't be careful now with a bed. Yeah, be careful with your clothes on it, Sean, because on your bag, look, it'll be a bit sore. Just be careful. Yeah, it looks nice. <laughs> oh, we're going in a scary shop. I've been in here with the younger kids, the younger children. The girls are taking pictures with Pennywise. <laughs> Ooh. Who's that, Shannon? She looks like that, um Lily, look at E.T. above your head. <laughs> E.T. phone home. I'll be back. Oh my days. Oh my dad would have loved this. Ooh. If I can remember, he's called Jar Jar Binks him, Shannon. 
Jar Jar Binks. Oh, this shop is fab, guys. There's Jar Jar Binks. Fab. Cody, look who we saw. <laughs> Superman, Shannon Togoda. Cody, find the best one. Cody and Jenna. Right well, Ant Man's over there. Let's have a look. Oh, I'll be obsessed. He looks like Sp Spider Man, but he's not Spider Man, him. he's Ant Man, isn't it? Is he Ant Man? No, he's. I don't know who he is. <laughs> Hobbs will tell me when I get home when I show him. <laughs> Aww. Not, um, um, I'm not, sure it's Ant Man. It's not Ant Man. It's sure it is. Oh, is he a film? I've seen him. I don't know, I don't know. Well, that's our when we get home when we show him the footage. <laughs> The Man City players. Shannon, your dad will be in his element here, won't I? And the boys. <laughs> Look down, it's Phil Foden. It's Phil Foden up here. Wow, I absolutely love it. Debrina. Debrina. Oh, Riley's obsessed with Debrina, isn't he? Loves them. But there's loads, absolute loads. They watched the game yesterday, didn't they? Was it yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, they watched the game yesterday. I jumped up. He went, Come on! Heavy pregnant and walking around town, especially in this heat, is really hard. Um, so we've just wanted to go to Disney shop, but it shut down. Proper devastated. Really, really devastated. It's gone because we wanted to have a look at in there for Jennifer Beth in October, um, but it's gone. So we're going to go upstairs in a minute and we'll go to the food chain. Um, so we're just outside duty three for a minute. Oh, sorry. Sweating the back on the time. The girls are just sat here moaning at each other. <laughs> Shannon's still not found any shoes. Have you, Shannon? Eh? Shannon, have you found any shoes? No. Guys, 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 my bathroom feel. Yes. So I'm not shouting from far distance. So I'm basically, you guys will know what I mean from um, Netflix and it's H2O guys. You'll know what I mean if you hear it. Do you want to hear my accent? Go then. Leo, get out of the water. Leo, get out of the water. Yeah. It's like, like <laughs> Jade, get out of the water. Are you Australian? <laughs> That's the whole point. Oh, was it? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know I could sound Australian. Yeah, you sound really good. I love good. Australian voices. I love yeah. them. So cute. I can do a Liverpool accent, guys. I'm really I good at a Liverpool accent. She can. She actually can. Yeah. Do one. Say my name in it. Oh, it's been ages since I've done it. Show Lily May. Lily May. Get Lily May to get Lily May to that. Right. What, should, what should I say? It's right. Um. Shannon, we go over there and get that, please. Just go over there and ask how much that, um, how much them nails are. And I'll go and get my nails done from over there. Got your nails done. <laughs> Mainly joking. I've already got them done, guys. I love that accent. You're actually good at it. Do you think so? Yeah. I'm brilliant, aren't I? Yeah. <laughs> I told you guys. <laughs> my Australian voice thought as well. Yours is really good, Australia. Cleo, get out of the water. <laughs> Do it. It's so good. <laughs> yeah, I could really do a really good Liverpool accent. I used to do it all the time when I was younger. Um, so, yeah, I used to love doing it. Um, so, anyway, we'll go up there, get some sweet, and then might have a nip in Primark as well. Um, so, yeah, come on. Yeah, I'm starving. <laughs> I've now got some food, finally. I am starving right now. So hungry. Got McDonald's. Shannon got chicken nugget meal, didn't you, Shannon? Did you get Lily May? Mm. You got a burger. Mm. So, the girls went up there and after it, and I went in here, boots, because I totally forgot that boot, this boots sell um, brands and things like that. You had a subscriber comment to me on our last vlog that boots. Um, I totally forgot that boots sell newborn baby things and prams and things. So I've just been in there, but we only, we only got the one pram in that you can look at. 
and we've got some amazing stuff. Thanks for reminding me. Um, it's our new subscriber. Thanks for reminding me that Boots Do Babe stuff because I totally forgot. Totally forgot. So I've just had a look in there. Oh, guys, look at these. Mom. They're absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Just get this for Bella. No. One of them with a little body warm like that was it. No, because it's so a Bella. Death, that is what you actually have on now. Isabella's only she seven. Would, she would love that. No. No. <laughs> Look how short the top is. Uh, see, but yeah, that's cute. That's cute. I, I like just, that. I just made the jacket a little bit cropped. Oh my days, she's seven, Shannon. That star one is nice though, but no, she's a bit young for crop frilly tops. Socks here. But we're looking for frilly socks for school. And um, they do have these in. Um, they are so cute. Eight pound they are, it's not bad. See, these are cute as well, these ones up here. Um, She'd need a size one. Let's see if they got a one for Isabel. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, they're lovely those. So cute. And then I'm gonna look for some frilly socks, but look at these. How amazing are them? Even them ones as well. They are lovely. Absolutely lovely they are. Um, but we're here for skill shoes. <laughs> um, so I'm after some frilly socks now. I've got some frilly. There we go. Oh, they're a bit big. I need. Um, I think I'm going to go with the plain black ones. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna go for the plain black, so I need to find her size. Shannon's just doing TikToks. Shannon, can you just bend down here? Because I can't bend down. See if you can see Isabel's size in a plain black. What size is she? Um, she's in um, ones now. She's in a size one shoe, so. Guys, look, we're on the baby section now. Oh my days. Uh, are you still taking the makeup out of me? Yeah, <laughs> You know, because I can't bend down from my belly button. Yeah. You know, like you can't when you go, oh, Shannon, <laughs> get me this. <laughs> oh, I'm Shannon, look. I'm crying right now, guys. Uh, been on for a while. Shannon's out. God, guys. We never see, we never see Shannon, really. Really, can I tell him back home? <laughs> as far as anything um yeah so shannon's gone out now with her, her and lilla i've gone to meet the rest of their friends so yeah so she's going to be home in not long actually we've been on a while now i haven't got my watch on um so yeah they've gone to meet up and yeah just chill out so shannon well today was for shannon to get her school shoes her bag um and school socks like she likes the pop socks and the frilly socks you know guys if you've got teenage daughters you know the stuff they like especially them really really frilly ones that are in at the minute and um, that they used to do for baby they still do them for babies but they do them for teenage girls now and they're they're what they are what are in at the minute but she didn't get any of them today and she didn't get her shoes because i was pretty pretty um disappointed in the Ardale, Manchester Ardale today because usually they've got loads of girly shoes you know school going back to school shoes but they didn't have any and they didn't even have any Primark for her as well so there's a shop closer to home that the shoes that she wants um so she's gonna go there and get them so yeah but anyway she picked her bag up so she she's gone with a plain black bag um so yeah she got this from Primark today I think it was a tenner or something. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't know how much she paid for it. But that's a new school bag. It's quite nice actually. I'd like this actually. It's quite nice. Smart. 
Um, they're in white and pink and yeah, it was lovely. She wanted to play Batwoman though for school. So yeah, she's got that. And as you guys seen in Primark, I got this award reward chart because seriously, um, the kids are getting a bit fed up now, guys. Because obviously we're, it's the holidays and, you know, routine gets messed up in the six weeks holidays. I don't know if you guys are the same, but that's how it is in our house. Like, sleeping patterns, especially with Keegan. Like, um, how can I explain? His behaviour, his, his sleeping routine is really bad at the minute. Really bad. He's sleeping. He's just not sleeping. And um, his behaviour... And things and it's, it's just confused he don't understand like he said the other day we're going to school his taxi coming and that's another thing i'm getting really annoyed with as well um well i did ring him up yesterday uh transport for keegan like he's still getting a taxi to school he's still not five months he's not had transport for and um, so i rang him up yesterday and i said i need it sorted now because it's, it's really starting to annoy me um, so yeah, I've told him that he needs to have transport by September because trans he goes special school. Transport is um, provided for him, but we've got to take him. We've got to take him every single day for the last five months. And yeah, when you've got other kids to get to school, it's it's quite hard, guys. It really is a struggle. So I said, uh, I'm just gonna put some complaints in. If he doesn't have transport by this September, um, because he was took off his bus because the basically the warden wasn't trained to like put special need harnesses on and things like that. So yeah, I'm a pr I'm pretty annoyed. I'm pretty annoyed. Um, so hopefully it's sorted. It starts when I was on the phone yesterday. She said she'll they will try and get it sorted. I said <laughs> basically it's got to get sorted because. I've got John Cho starting school now, I've got Coda, I can't like, um, Keegan's get, because Keegan's school's out of the way, like I've got the younger children to get to school, like Isabel, Riley, and then I've got John Jo that's starting a different school to the older, to Riley and Isabel, so you know, I can't like be where Keegan needs to be, where it's out of our area, and then take Isabel and Ryla and then take John Jo. It's just, it can't happen. At least Isabella and Ryla and John Jo, they're close to each other, so it'll be easy to just drop Isabella and Riley off. And then John Jo, because the schools are not far from each other, but Keegan's is a bit like far. It's, it's going to be hard and having the new baby as well. This transport needs to sort itself out. But anyway, I've got this chat because of behaviour, like I said at the minute, especially with the babies. The babies. Um, so, yeah, I've showed it Cody already. He absolutely loves it because it is his favourite, favourite man in the whole wide world. It is Spider-Man. So, I picked this up for all of them. But I was I was thinking in there, oh, do you know what? I don't want Isabel having a reward chat, like, with Spider-Man on it. So, I had to look round, um, you know, just... The, the kids say I walk like a penguin now, guys. You know, because you get that heavy... And you, you're just walking with the pregnancy walk. The kids are laughing at me saying, Mum, you walk like a penguin. So I waddled round Primark looking for a girly one. And then I come across Minnie Mouse. A Minnie Mouse reward chart. So Bella's got her own. Um, so I said to Bella, I said, You won't be on your own for much. Obviously, Shannon's not going to have a reward chart at her age. Um, but when baby girl comes, she'll be joining you on there. So you won't be on your own. Um, so yeah. I'm going to see how it goes, see if it helps with Kia again, um, especially the two babies as well, because they're at that age now, the copy and the older ones, like I try to tell the older ones, like they need to watch what they're listening to now, because they're 17 and 16, and they're into like, you know, the, you know, the boys rapping and H and all that, and I get a bit annoyed because... I say, like, keep the um, volume to a certain level, certain thing where you can hear it, but Johnny and Cody can't because they'll just repeat it. And I'm forever, ever telling the teenagers, and it does my head in, because obviously John Joe's starting school in September, and I don't want him coming out with, like, rapping things. The camera was right out of memory. So, yeah, as I was saying, I don't want the boys, like, well, the two younger boys coming out with, like, 
um, rapping talk, you know how it is guys. And some of it has swearing in as well. So I don't want them coming out with stuff like that. Um, anyway, so I got our vial of these, um, like Jordan's for school, because he wants to try a trainer type one, because he likes to play football um, and things like that. So this September, he is starting football um, in our area. So these are not for him. Obviously, he's going to need football boots, but yeah, he loves to play football in school. So solid, solid shoe there. I look for solid, solid shoes. I did want these for Keegan, but they didn't have Keegan's size. So what I'm going to do for Keegan is get like the boots I got last time with a high back because um, Keegan has where he's like I've said to you guys his feet turn in so when he's got them like boots his feet stay straight so yeah and I got Miss Isabella Miss Isabella Edwards I got her these gorgeous back to school shoes um so yeah I was pretty buzzing with Primark today on little girls shoes um, so these are absolutely beautiful. She's seen them before. I said, Bella, I got your school shoes. She went, oh yeah, can I see them? So I went, yeah. So she come in, she had a look. Oh, she went, mum, they're full of glitter, they're beautiful. I went, no, no, they are. Um, so these were, you know what, good, solid shoe. Like usually Primark, usually sell like the dolly shoes. You know the ones that break dead easy, like they've got like the thing going across so that's what I was expecting Primark to have today not proper like solid school shoes and for £8 like I was looking in Tesco the other day uh, so if you're getting something like this in Tesco or Sainsbury's Sainsbury's is worse I think Sainsbury's is so expensive when it comes to shoes like charge 20 odd pound 20 odd pound 17, 15, 16 pound when you can go to Primark guys and get them for eight quid. Absolute bargain. So I thought I'd let you guys know. Um, look how cute. Shiny black painted with little whiskers and pure glitter there, guys. So she loves them. She absolutely loves them. So, like I said, if you're going like to Asda and things like that, and no, Asda's not so bad, to be honest with you. Asda's not as dear, but Tesco and Sainsbury's for school shoes. Oh my days. No way, Jose. And then these were down in price. So I got the boys some um, NFL, is it? Yeah, that's it. NFL sliders, just for around the house, the two teenagers. They love them. And I got these memory foam ones. So, guys, all the sandals are down to three and four pounds because they're bringing all the boots in, like I showed you on the um, in Primer. They're bringing all the boots in and stuff. So, all these are memory foam ones. And seriously, I love them. The memory film. I loved them that much. I changed them as soon as I got out of Primark. <laughs> because my other ones, like the white ones I've got, they keep cutting into my feet and they're hurting me really bad for. So I'm going to show you what else I picked from Primark today. Oh yeah, I got myself two pairs because these were four pounds. Well, no, these ones were a fiver, but that's because they've got like a chain type effect here uh, because they look more more finger but yeah they were a fiver and these ones i got on were four pound or three pound one of them but yeah i've got myself them as well so i got myself some because i'm loving wearing sandals because obviously i'm getting swollen feet now guys seriously and it's, it's starting to hurt and my feet are starting to kill especially when i've been on them all day i'm never off them let me just move you guys up there um and all the lol stuff is down in price as well um so i'll pick these up for isabel um she's buzzing with them this LOL all-in-one summer suit here with shorts, shorts attached, this was down to £3. LOL, guys. LOL. LOL. Seriously, I love going to Manchester one because they just have so much than the one in Berry. Because the one in Berry is just so small and they don't have as much. Like, this LOL thing should have been £7. Oh, look, 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 look recycling shorts. She's not seen these yet. This was down to £3 for the full set as well. So even, even you know, because summer's coming to an end soon, if you wanted to wear them in pyjamas in the winter, you know, you know, you know, guys. And then I got this one. I think this is an Elsa one. Um, this Elsa one, this was £3 as well. 
and with the little shorts so i couldn't not not get them i know i said i wasn't going to buy any more summer clothes but for three pound so that was like three outfits six for nine pound three outfits frozen lol and the other one what was it no two lol sets i thought it was a bargain and then baby girl has not got a single bib she's got everything else but no bibs so as you guys see in today i got some bibbies i got her some bibbies um so i got smile ha smile happy days happy baby i mean um they are two pound eight for five and then i got a five more i love my family two pound eighty for five again and then i'm gonna put these straight upstairs some more of these um these are five pound as well the only ones that freak me out is the ones you know you tie but i don't think they sell them anymore not come across them anyway uh, they're very dangerous i don't like them scare me and then i got keegan and riley some nfl drama sets i want to be quick guys because i don't want to drag this video on for you guys i don't know how long it's going to be to be honest we are some more nfl um oh them shorts to isabel's outfit there oh no we've got a four outfits actually four of them that was down to two pound that one but that one's not like frozen or anything that's just an ice cream cone and shorts i think that was two pound for the whole outfit so that's like nine ten eleven eleven pound for four outfits can't go wrong and then i got these cubes with numbers on for the little boys um especially coded so all numbers and things they're cute as well so after the boys are finished using them i'm gonna put them away for the baby as well um so elastic bands for isabelle's hair because i love to do braids and things in her hair and then Shannon, she got some bodysuits here. She got a pink one. I think these were £6, these. She got a pink one, a white one. And then I got myself um, some tops, bigger size tops. Because this one, this one fit me perfect. But now, I see my bump comes right up and just pushes everything up. I got myself like a lime green tracksuit here. And what else did... Oh, Shannon got this gorgeous top on sale. This, guys. This beautiful top. And because, like, um, autumn's coming up, it'll go really nice. So she paid £3 for that. £3 she did. She got herself a little bargain. And then I got Isabella some of the black frilly socks. I'd rather go with the black ones, me, because every time I get the white ones... Comment down below if you mummies are the same. Getting the white frilly socks ones. Um, especially when they're walking around the house or whatever. Or they go out in the garden. And then they turn black like the dirty colour. And you wash them and they still don't look clean. So that's why. I think I save myself money getting the black ones. Because obviously the black ones they'll, they'll go clean. But the white ones. They're very hard to get back white. Seriously. <laughs> they're really hard to just get back to the white. So... I just buy the black ones now because I end up throwing them away. I do. I end up throwing them away. So because I can never get them back to white. And then I got some um, Shannon's makeup wipes. My makeup wipes. And yeah, that's it, guys. How long have I been on here? Now? Eight minutes. I don't know how long this video is going to be. And now it's time for the children's bedtime because we've not long just had dinner. Um, they had their dinner when we were still out actually, hubs fed the kids from her. Um, it's a diamond in that way. But anyway, I need to end this vlog because I don't know how long it's going to be guys. Because if you like this video guys, give us a big thumbs up. And I want to say a big thank you to all you guys that support our family and have helped us build this channel. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. God bless you all. God bless you all. Thanks for subscribing guys. So, I will see you in our next vlog. Um, I think we're, we're going to be cutting the garden, starting the gardens out tomorrow, so I might film that, um, something different of show you the front garden and what we're going to be doing. So, if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up guys, keep watching and keep subscribing and we'll carry on building this channel together. Thanks for watching guys, peace out.